At 10, we have a developing story for you with nationwide health care costs increasing. Amarillo ISD is finding itself in a position needing to update its insurance plan. News Channel 10, Sydney Vatslav joins us to break down the cost increases employees will soon see. The Amarillo ISD board voted recently approving an increase in its medical insurance premiums. For the consumer-driven health plan, this change will increase premiums by 16%. It will also increase the out-of-pocket maximum by 50%. Now, for the Preferred Provider Organization, or PPO, this change will bring a 16% increase to AISD insurance premiums. I know the district's in a hard place, but that can't be something that staff members are paying for. The Amarillo Education Association says without substantial pay raises, district employees are going to see less take-home pay, leaving many frustrated. I know a lot of educators, teachers, and support staff are taking on second and sometimes even third jobs to make ends meet right now. I've heard a lot of stories, and there was even public comment of folks who are selling their plasma to make make ends meet. We reached out to Amarillo ISD about the matter. In a statement, the district says its health insurance plan remains the best offering of any school district in the area. It also states AISD contributes over $6,000 a year to every employee on its plan. Aaron Phillips says on top of inflation, there is no room for extra costs. And I've heard people tell me because of not knowing how to make ends meet on this pay, they are going to look at everything they can do to get out of education. Um, many folks might go to another district, but honestly, the sad reality is people are just leaving education altogether because they can't afford to teach. The Amarillo Education Association believes if more teachers leave, class sizes will become larger and education will suffer. Amarillo ISD says these insurance changes go into effect July 1st.